Excuse me, miss, but after this kiss, where do I fall upon your lips?
<laughs> hello hello Hi. internet we we have to we have to stop discussing some top secret bad top time secret. record stuff to get this stream going it's hot Whew. the oh, secrets yeah. are hot oh yeah <laughs> keep an eye on that <laughs> nintendo direct that's all i have to say <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> uh, well well thanks for being here <laughs> everybody yeah, yeah, everybody. Thank you for being here in the chat. We are going to listen to 
the first bat time records release of the year yes yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's not dissidenti sorry guys yeah it's not dissidenti it's yeah, actually nope. <laughs> it's adele hit it dc <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's no, we're kidding. It's Dissidente. It's the War on Two Fronts by Dissidente. Hey, hey. So uh, yeah, I'm stoked. Yeah. I mean, I re- I've already heard the record, but I'm yeah, still stoked. yeah, I heard it too. Yeah, Y'all are in for it. I got a real bad memory. <laughs> <laughs> Just every time that record plays, it's the first time for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like fifty first dates. Yeah. It's <laughs> Yeah. 51st Dissidente re- premieres. <laughs> 51st Dissident Dates. Oh! Hey, hey. <laughs> this is already the perfect level of chaotic. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Are we uh, ready to rock? Yeah. Let's just get into it, right? Yeah. Chris, Chris yeah. Vadim, Jeremy, let's all strap in. Let's yeah. do it. We're going to hit play. Whoa! 
Damn. Just got done moshing yeah. emotionally. Not physically. <laughs> <laughs> Not physically. I'm too tired for that. I'm emotionally, here. I'm emotionally moshing right now. <laughs> I'm working through some stuff. I'm emotionally mosh. I mean, that's actually accurate. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah right. Oh yeah. The last yeah. two years, there's been a lot of emotional moshing. Yeah. Yeah. Tons. Yeah. Yeah. Those, uh, yeah. those are two very aggressive opening tracks. Like they're very yeah. fast, very heavy, heavy on the core, light on the mm-hmm. ska. Light on the sky. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> you meet the quota. It's okay. Yeah. After, re- after review the record beforehand, before it was yeah. Mike put it out, I was like, I gotta meet the sky quota. Yeah. <laughs> I sent it to Jeremy, and there's like, it's like, you know, like with figure skating, there's like a certain number of, you get a certain number of points for a certain number of, I don't know. There's, I don't know where I'm going with this. I was trying to do like an Olympics okay. thing because it's happening. Like, anyway. Okay, continue. <laughs> DC hit it. No, I'm just. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, we were talking about 45. So, like, you you put out 45. Like, that's one of the one of the only songs on the album that you put out early, right? Like, you yeah. put that out a long time ago. So when we were sitting on the recordings. Um, is when the January 6th coup happened. And so we said, okay, now is the fucking time to release this. Like we don't, we don't have to wait for this at all. Yeah. It just made perfect sense to hit it on that day. Like I was completely convinced like, Oh, this is the beginning of the second civil war. So <laughs> Jesus <laughs> like, Christ. <laughs> right. right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's like, seems like it. <laughs> You're right. So yeah. I so I was convinced. I was like, okay, well, I, I at least want people to be able to hear one song before I die in a violent insurrection. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, that was a, a good call. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thanks, uh, thanks. But uh, how? I mean, you y'all were sitting on this record for a long time. Yeah. So actually, we when- we started recording it. Um, before our guitarist Rhett moved to Chicago. So we were like, okay, we have like two months. We know he's moving. He did he move to get his three Yeah, two years ago, I guess. Timelines don't make sense. Don't try to No, time not at all. Yeah. yeah. Timelines with the past two the, years doesn't mean anything. It's in the <laughs> time before. is fake. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so um so yeah, so we we were like rushing to get stuff recorded before he had to move. And um then we just kind of we're able to tweak stuff after that. Yeah. Yeah, which is kind of wild. Yeah, actually, it didn't take a long time to record it. It, it was more yeah. like, uh, I mean, uh, we did fast. Yeah, and we, we recorded it all DIY, too. So, like, we were in our drummer's house, and, um, you know, we mic'd up the drum set in his basement, and I recorded all the vocals in a closet, and <laughs> 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 it sounds all right, I think. That sounds fucking good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm honestly impressed. I'm like, damn, that sounds great. My recordings sound like shit from my house. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> well, That's not true, Jeremy. Stop it. Yeah. Come up to Pittsburgh. We'll record you in my closet. <laughs> oh, heck yeah. <laughs> we were laughing about it, actually, because uh, we got a good sound in this basement. So uh, I always yeah. like, love to play there because it's been yeah, it's, really it's tight, sound. tight, tight, yeah, tight sound. Especially for I was, basement. I was very impressed. I was like, "What studio did you all do this?" Yeah, it just happened. It's uh, we didn't like do it like like in some special way, you know. No, uh, yeah, do, mm-hmm. like uh, something with the walls or stuff. Yeah, <laughs> something with walls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like, you know, yeah. Like, just, hell yeah. Like, yeah, all the all materials, the, the acoustic paneling yeah, and shit. Yeah, yeah, nothing like that. It's real raw. No. It's real raw. Fuck all that. You know. Yeah, know. it's <laughs> DIY, baby. <laughs> DIY or or. Or don't. <laughs> or don't. Or don't. Yeah, why or don't? Yeah. It's all fine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, did we miss anything good in the chat, Jeremy? Or aside from no, the- every comment was terrible. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Eichler's likes that were purple, like you and me. Our lighting is purple. Oh hell yeah! That's, <laughs> that's the highlight of the chat that I saw. Gosh, There's some butterflies gosh. in the chat. That's that's cool. <laughs> Butterfly. I will say there's a lot of comments about the uh, about the uh, stage dives and and uh, drives there. We have some comments about pierogies and uh, oh, yeah. the, the cookbook. Uh, hi. <laughs> Just hi. Yeah. 
I got a shout out to Elliot Springfield because Elliot made the pierogies from Elliot's made everything first. Elliot made yeah. the pierogies. Elliot just made the Jer meatloaf. I was waiting for somebody to make the Jer meatloaf. I'm oh yeah. Yeah, that thing's a pain to make. <laughs> Apparently the pierogies are a pain too. Yeah, yeah. It's not a be- it's not a beginner's cookbook. Okay, because ska is not a beginner's music. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what this isn't a fucking never mind. I'm about to get canceled by some music scene. <laughs> because if you're in, if you're listening to Sky, you're probably in your 30s. So you probably yeah. know how to cook by now. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's like a gate you have to get. Uh, I don't know. Some, some gatekeeper. Joke. Oh, trust me. I know. Keep the gate. <laughs> you keep the gate. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, I got pizza. You want pizza? Pizza. Oh, yeah. Chris, are you, sharing, are you sharing pizza or what? Yeah, we, got, we got a vegan buffalo, awesome. chick, uh, buffalo it's, chicken pizza. Took you two songs to bust out the whiskey and the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> you're, 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 you're ready. You're, We're having a good time. I'm not going to work tomorrow. Fuck that. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. Nobody in the chat should go to work tomorrow either. Yeah, yeah. Right. right. Fuck it. Strike. Economic boycott <laughs> in honor of the new Dissidente record. Boy Scott, yeah. Oh, 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 boy Scott, yeah, perfect. (laughs) You're killing me. (laughs) All right, I think we should roll the next. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's do Join the-
up there that we like Then we took a few minutes to fuck up And there's no one to blame Like a tree on the bank of a river Widened from rising waters Generations of birth can't resist And the storage of the money current With no witness to pay Black cat, 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 cat
What's up, everybody? Yo, it's getting draining doing all this emotional moshing and a little <laughs> actual moshing, but mostly emotional still. Yeah, there's holes all up in my wall here, so I'm fucked. Yeah, yeah the walls in my you. mind are crumbling from, <laughs> from the moshing. It's Never getting my security deposit back. <laughs> yeah. On my brain. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's too much. That was that 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 block had some ska. A yeah, we're a ska, ska. band. Yeah. Tricked you. Yeah, tricked you. You <laughs> thought they were heavy, but here's the ska. Yeah. Uh, so in just my notes about what we should talk about, because we usually we usually have like more interesting conversation while the songs are playing than on the stream. On the stream. <laughs> I have two I have two notes. I have two notes. Okay, here's what my notepad says. Jeremy, your notepad's more interesting at this point, but I'll oh, read yes. my I'll read mine. Yeah. Mine just says grandma. <laughs> and Sh- and Cheryl Crow. <laughs> so you want to talk? About, do you want to talk about Grandma first? Uh, yeah, we'll talk about. Well, all right, yeah, let's all talk right. about Grandma first. Okay. okay so, uh, yeah. So, well, uh, did you want to talk about Cheryl Crow? I mean, whatever. It's your stream. no, I mean, no. We'll save Cheryl Crow. That's the real. That's the real fucking. Banger. Okay. Cool. Okay. Um. So, uh, for the piano in Pocalania, um, oh, yeah. I uh wrote the piano um sheet music out and then my gave it to my grandma to record it because she has alzheimer's and so it was like i figured the last chance that i'd have to like get her playing on like record um yeah so like and she's still she's still alive still with us and i think it's the only way i'm going to convince uh anybody from my family to listen to this record is to be like no but grandma's on it grandma's playing the piano uh, you haven't you sent have it to her yet like she hasn't heard, has she heard it yet i don't know that she's heard much lately <laughs> okay yeah i mean it, it is what i um <laughs> grandma okay I'm, this is totally unrelated um but because grandma has alzheimer's uh, my wife and I, we got like secretly married and didn't tell anybody. And I figured, I was like, grandma, she don't have much time left. Right. So like, I'll tell her she's not going to remember or tell anybody. So like, I told my grandma and she spilled the beans to everyone. <laughs> like, she, And like, and like well, told she... my parents probably the same day. And like, <laughs> and then like my parents, and it was like two years later, they confronted. They're like, why didn't you tell us that you were married? I was like, <laughs> What? You can't underestimate well, grandma. Like, that was your mistake. You can't underestimate yeah. grandma. Come on. Yeah. That was a huge mistake. Huge error. <laughs> <laughs> um, but how did you, how did you get like, did you go in there and record grandma or did like, yeah, we just had like a, a little, grandma like, have pro tools. Like, I don't yeah. know. <laughs> but, <laughs> grandma, grandma's a real badass man. She's using an able to <laughs> shit. Like, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, I just went over there one day with uh, a little, um, like a little Tascam or like Zoom recorder, like handheld recorder, and just like recorded her playing it a couple times, and then uh, that was it. It was cool too. Like she's, I mean, I I originally recorded it on my piano at home, which is like mm-hmm. total horse shit, um, which was part of like the story. Like Pocalania means generations, and it's about like generational poverty and how like it's impossible to escape that shit. So like it was supposed to be like this fucking thing like me playing it her grandson on my shit piano and then her playing it on her you know nice uh, piano and and it turns out that i wasn't as good a piano and i just used her <laughs> take instead <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah well it sounds sick i mean that's yeah one yeah of thank coolest you parts on the record um i don't know jeremy did you have any did you have any good notes you wanted to share with the class <laughs> <laughs> you might <laughs> My list of, of fake shitty ska band names. Um, yeah, sure, I, sure. Why not? <laughs> well, I feel like you should just give us one. Just give us one. Give just give us one. one. So just I'm going to give the, the one that I think was the best of the five that I gave that all yeah. have the same formula, which yeah. is a Rudy revolution in the guillotones. Rudy <laughs> revolution in the guillotones. That's the next band. That's the next uh, bad time band. Look out. 
summer 2025 rudy revolution in the guillotones with their debut lp give me liberty or give me two hep. two step and hep. yeah there we go oh, thank you so much <laughs> There it is. Give me liberty or give me hep. Mark, right. mark, mark the words of this video. Watch there actually be a revolution in this country in 2025. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like everything's burning and I'm like, I'm just going to Scott vague... record. <laughs> <laughs> in two <laughs> years, I'm just going to vague tweet. Uh, this is a album release stream, the fall of the American empire. And then everyone's going to be like, what? And then two years later, the revolution's going to start. And I'm just like, <laughs> what did I tell you? <laughs> It's a good guess. It's a good guess to make. It's always a good guess. Oh shit. Okay. Well. Okay. My other note was Cheryl, Cheryl Crow. You want to talk about? Because I know you wanted to talk about that after Corvid, right? Uh, after Labor Day, but oh, after Labor Day. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that's a yeah. Nothing she happened. Got, yet. We got like like nine months. Hello. <laughs> 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 <Wow. laughs> I think we should keep listening to the record. Yeah, and also, good. also everybody in the chat, uh, we're gonna do a giveaway. Uh, we're gonna give away some of the the frontline EPs, uh, and oh, there's one. And uh, maybe we'll give away just like a, a vinyl of the of the War on Two Fronts. Cool. Yeah, we'll do that at the end, so you have to watch the whole thing. Okay, let's go.
That was a close one. That was a close one. Oh, yeah, one. we were talking Ooh. psychology. Yeah, uh, we were talking the about the scenes. Yeah. yeah, it was getting real heavy for a minute. Yeah. So, <laughs> speaking of heavy, um, those <laughs> last couple <laughs> tracks. <laughs> yeah, Amputee is such a good song. Um, yeah, I, I love that one. So that one, I, we actually have something to talk about now. Oh. So, like, yeah, brace your fucking sounds. Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> um, so I had uh, an accident at work, like right when like Dissidenti kind of became Dissidenti. And uh, I cut off uh, an inch out of, off of my finger. And I never thought I would. Yeah, like I can oh like, God. yeah, like I don't know if you can oh, see that. Yeah, dude. Right? And I, so I never thought I was going <sighs> to ever play guitar again. And so I was like, oh fuck, like I'm I, I got real addicted to fucking painkillers and I was drinking way more. And I was like, okay, this is the end of my life, right? So when I first started playing guitar again, that was like one of the very first riffs I ever wrote. Cause it was something I had written for uh for keyboards way before this ever existed. And but I was like trying to learn how to play. And so when I was playing, it was something that had to be like I had to utilize a lot of chromaticism because with my middle finger, I had to make sure I was still using that finger. Yeah. Like, so that riff being like super, super chromatic is the reason why I'm still able to play guitar today. That's nuts. That's yeah. Like, right. Kind of cool. That's a cra- <laughs> yeah. I was, I'm like almost afraid when you have a song called amputee, I'm almost afraid to like ask like, what's that about? Like you yeah. have to have all your limbs. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the thing. But like, so my buddies are always giving me shit. They're like, well, you're not really an amputee, you know. <laughs> like, sure, I was like, yeah, sure. yeah. But but you went you went through a traumatic experience, like losing yeah, an inch right. off your finger and not being sure if you could ever play guitar again. Like that's serious. Sure. Like and, that's a big deal. For the workers' comp, it says uh, an amputation of the left distal phalanx. So <laughs> it, it like so it does say amputated. There you go. Yeah, I'm considered <laughs> technically an amputee, guys. All right. Well, yeah. Um, amputee passing. Uh, yeah. Amputee yeah. Passing. By the way, yeah, it's a really fun. Riff. And then fucking Jerry. the bass solo in that one fucking rips. Uh, yeah. Like... <laughs> he's he's, he's doing like Mario a. Brothers. Yeah, he's doing a Mario Brothers. He's kind of close. Hell yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the bass solo and that is ridiculous. The bass on this whole record is ridiculous. Like, yeah, no, seriously, dude, it's crazy. So like, here, uh, when Vadim and I first met, because um, I had been playing with our drummer for a while before that, um, but you you were only in the states for like a couple of months. Like, yeah. yeah, and so like the when just we, literally a couple of months. Yeah, so we couldn't we couldn't communicate like linguistically. Yeah, my English so was like uh we call it uh dark english yeah <laughs> it's a dark english <laughs> so i was oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but uh anyway we communicated uh very good i mean uh, yeah with, with the music like, with yeah. riffs yeah because like yeah. you know i'd be like diddly, diddly, and then you know he'd... yeah because Fuck when I english that, riffs <laughs> play with some with the american like uh native speaker you know yeah. because uh i grew up on the bands like i don't know nirvana like american bands yeah yeah and uh, okay. yeah i always liked uh, the way you guys like uh screaming because uh i i don't know for some reason i, I think there there's a lot of uh especially american musicians uh like singers who really mm-hmm. can like scream or or like use like overdrive like kurt Cobain, like yeah yeah like you get a growl yeah it's yeah. uh, always hard for me, and uh, and when I first time 
like heard the uh, when Chris sang like uh, first song we like tried to play it, mm-hmm. it was cool. Like I was, like, yeah, oh, like, yeah. Chris has I, a hell of hell of a growl. Yeah, as well. yeah it's angry. I, I think the and seeing like and clear clearly or like uh, scream and, and yeah. always like something. I think the coolest thing was that you you just said you guys, which was me and Kurt Cobain. <laughs> 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 like, that together. Yeah, you, you American guys. You American Chris singers. And Kurt Cobain. Uh, no, I mean, I, I didn't mean... <laughs> the two genders. <laughs> the two genders. I just meant to play. No, no I, I got you. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> A long okay. line of... Oh, boy. That's yeah, you know, that's the, one, the, the first example. Uh, got, that's my... Yeah, it has, still has <laughs> yeah. that, like, that growl to it, that little, like, yeah, looser... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. Yeah, hell yeah. Well, yeah, the bass playing on this is it's fucking amazing. Sick. Yeah, yeah the, the growling <laughs> is amazing. Um, yeah, I know. The, I know the chat's moshing. I haven't been really paying attention to the chat. No, I haven't I, been paying I miss, attention. Did I miss anything in there? Anything? A there? lot of people saying Scott puns of workers comp, like a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize there's so many ways you could fit the word Scott into that. More like bad time comp. Yeah, there you go. Okay, nice. I love cutting Fingy off as a treat. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, that's, Sam. That's getting kind of unhinged. They're getting a little unhinged. <laughs> that's 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 a little, it's a little dangerous. Uh, <laughs> as a treat. As a treat, you can have a little Fingy cut off as a treat. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. Well, how many tracks do we have left? So we just did ellipsis, right? So that's the that's actually the end of side A. A yeah. So we have yeah. all of side B to go. So we should oh, listen God. to the music. I'm supposed. I'm real quick. I'll say I'm supposed to work at five a.m. That shit ain't happening. No, oh, you ain't going. Fuck that. Don't, no, don't worry about that. Fuck work. Fuck work. In. National Scott strike. Dead. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. National Scott strike. You're canceled. Oh, there's only four songs left. I thought that ellipsis was the end of mm. side A. No? Oh, you know what? But there's that, you know what? Oh, know. the last track. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll talk about that later. So yeah, is yeah. is this the last block, DC? Okay, so we have the last oh. four tracks. Should we listen to them? Yeah. I don't want to hear myself speak anymore. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah, look at the kill. Stay close, give them to the wind. Forget things, 
stream. Wait, wait, wait. Restart the stream. Re no, oh, just wait. <laughs> <laughs> Right, that was I a missed... great test run, guys. That was yeah. great. That was a really good test. Now we're going to actually do the stream and listen to the record, okay? <laughs> no, actually, a, a test audience for the, the record. So, so that was the new system of a down record. But now we're going to listen to it. <laughs> <laughs> the new Taylor Swift is hitting different. <laughs> the new system of a upbeat. System uh, up a down. Right, up, oh, God, that's so bad. I hate myself. I hate <laughs> Well, that was the record. Yeah. Yay. Fuck there, yeah. there is actually one more song on the record that we're not playing here because it's like seven minutes long and it's pretty somber and it didn't seem appropriate to have for like this, yeah. this hanging out with buddies and celebrating and having fun. So it's intense, forward. but yeah. Yeah, look, it, thematically, it kind of closes the whole album. So consider this a cliffhanger until you get your copy in the mail or stream it tomorrow. Stream it tomorrow. It's out at midnight. Midnight, yeah. uh, so what, in like two, less than two hours. It'll I'm be so a... fucked for work tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you're in trouble. You're in yeah. trouble, buddy. Right, bro. <laughs> yeah. Um, should, we, should, we give, uh, should we give some seven inches away? <laughs> Yeah, let's do that shit. So here's how we're going to do it. We couldn't figure out a burner phone number, and we still don't have the, the Newtone hotline, but we're working on it. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to ask trivia questions, and the first – we're going to be watching the chat very closely. The first people to answer the trivia questions correctly in the chat, you win a 7-inch of the Frontline EP that will be mailed to you. Ooh. By Chris Adente. <laughs> um, I should have been calling you that for months. I don't know. Yeah, well, was. it was funny because I we saw I started playing like solo sets, and I think I can't remember who the fuck it was. It was one of the best of the worst cats. It may have been Jay that started calling me that. I was like, oh yeah, that's they're I'm going by that now. Yeah, it, it just makes too much sense. Speaking yeah. of which, they're they're playing a real show like right now. Right now, yeah, which yeah, is yeah. crazy. Yeah, um, hell yeah. Uh, all right, should we do the first question? Yes, please. Okay, first question is, what is the name of the venue that Dissidente and Kill Lincoln played together in Pittsburgh the first time we met? And this was yeah. 2018, 2017? I couldn't tell you. <laughs> 2017, uh, yeah, 2017 sounds right. Pittsburgh venue. What's the name of the venue that we played? I want to hear it. Shout out venues in the chat. Let's, and let's there's see. a there's a 30 second delay, so it's gonna be really awkward for like 30 seconds. When we're all yeah. just looking at the thing. <laughs> Harass Greg 2K22. Great. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, Middle East. That's that's in Boston. Nope, that's Boston. Boston. Brent says I booked that and I don't even remember. <laughs> Roboto. It was not Roboto. No, it no. was it was not Roboto, but Meet the first Ball. Dissidenti it's, show was at Roboto, actually. Mr. Smalls. It's not one of the – it's a weird room. I've never – like, I haven't seen many shows happen there. And I don't mm -hmm. even know if it's still a spot. Like, is it, it is. Still a... it's, it's my favorite. I will say it's a bar generally. It's my favorite bar in Pittsburgh. Well, I was just like – when you walk in and it's like 25-cent pierogies, like dollar icy lights, like, okay. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, like, we're gonna, we're, this is how we're – the best yeah. part is that they have the, the kitchen – right yeah. there it's like dude's putting fucking cigarettes in an ashtray right next to where he's preparing your pizza boats yeah pizza <laughs> oh and the pizza boats yeah it was yeah. like dollar pizza boats yeah i think it's 50 he, cents actually 50 if i'm not mistaken it's insane yeah. it was insane we, fucking we, rules. we were just chowing down it yeah. was awesome. oh flying raccoon. Uh, flying raccoon suit got it you win flying yeah. raccoon suit rock room it was was Sunday. the rock room? <laughs> yeah, but Deep said he knows it, so I think he won. Yeah, if I answered it, yeah. <laughs> Jeremy, I have to let you know you you have a, a a flashing red battery thing. Damn, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Should we hurry it up? Uh, no, I give me a second. I can fix that. I'll be right. Back. <laughs> Wait, don't go. Oh fuck, there it is. No, there it is. doesn't. Now it's now it's gonna look all fucked up on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh um, no wait 
Oh, back. great. I'm glad you're back. Um, yes, I will be. Right- I'll leave it on just okay. to make it work for the thing. I'll be right back, though. I just got to get the plug for my camera. <laughs> Pizza cone. <laughs> Oh, wait, dude, wait, I love how please. I love how fucked up it looks for a second. Yeah, so you can see trip. that, right? That's hilarious. <laughs> you, you went to a like technical a difficulty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. DC went to a technical difficulty slide. Are we are we still on right now, DC? Oh, okay, great. Oh my. Um, God. <laughs> well, let's do the next question then. Okay, okay. So, flying raccoon suit. I wrote that down. I'll get in touch with flying raccoon suit. Um, which all right. which one? Uh, who is it? Uh, on the... uh, I don't know if I don't know if it's probably Andrew. Okay. Oh, yeah. Who? Which? Who is on Flying Raccoon Suit? Let me know who's actually on the account right now. I'll, I'll hit you up. Well, I'll hit up one of them anyway. We'll figure it out. Okay. Okay. Let's do the next. Let's do the next question while Jeremy's uh, sorting their shit out. Mm-hmm. Um, so okay. <laughs> All right. So next question. This one is actually uh, about our the producer of the stream DC. Oh. So DC is behind the scenes making the stream happen. DC is the one who just made it look decent again. Yeah, holy shit. Good job. At, at the end of every stream, we always I, we always make a point to say thanks DC and go check out DC's band. What is the name of DC's band? What's the name of DC's band? I want to hear it in the chat. Cuz they they got a new record that's going to come out at some point in the future. Oh, hell yeah. Yes. I'm very excited to hear it. DC, how long has it been since your last record? Nine years. Wow. Fuck. That's too long. That's some killing. <laughs> that's some killing. <laughs> that that's some, uh, yeah. It'll be nine more years till the next record, okay? I'm not sad enough. No, I'm plenty sad. Uh, brace face Adam Davis got it he said well he said brave face first all right Adam Davis Adam you already have a frontline EP seven inch don't you I can, you know what I I have I have this cool poster <laughs> Donkey Kong country Adam I'll send you this instead yeah well send him a seven inch so he probably wants a seven yeah. inch yo yeah. what's up Jeremy Jeremy's back uh, I can't hey. the thing no so I was thinking about something before the stream I was Wait. Like, I feel like I'm forgetting to what what's up well, wait, Jer's here, but what happened to Scott's Who Network? Oh, you know what? Holy shit, you're right. Did you murder Scott's Who Network and take their place? You know, what can I say? <laughs> so fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, congratulations. It was it was Brace Face. Congratulations, uh, Adam Davis, who also is owed a leg. Uh, we owe Adam a leg from a previous live stream. I, I also owe him a shirt. That's true. My bad, buddy. All right, so so that goes to Adam. All right, so should we ask the next? I don't know. I don't think we should ask the next trivia question. Maybe we should come up with another one. The next trivia question is: When does the Jer record come out? <laughs> <laughs> if you said twenty twenty nine, you win. Twenty sixty nine. Twenty sixty nine. Oh, yeah. there we go. Twenty sixty nine. Comes out on April twentieth, twenty sixty nine. There it is. <laughs> uh, that'll be Jer Two. Oh, oh, Scott Jer, Electric Boogaloo. Jer Two Network. <laughs> yeah, Jer Two Network. <laughs> All right. Well, do, I don't know if we have another. Uh, let's let's. Can we can we come up with a third question real quick? Um, yeah, give away well, one more seven. <laughs> I just <laughs> cried to my friend. <laughs> <laughs> He's just right. Says, <laughs> All right, what's the name of Adib's friend? Ruslan. Ruslan. All right. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Um What uh what is the name of Chris's What what's the name of one of your other bands or musical projects? I oh yeah. Put another put another Chris Adente project in the chat. Yeah. There's there's specifically, a million, there's a lot of them. My, okay, how about how about the one? What's the name of the one where you um <laughs> that is centered around Pokemon? Yeah, my Pokemon band. Who's got that? Yeah. What's the name of the Pokemon band? Let's hear it. Yo, Jer all of two. these, <laughs> all of these uh these the I like the Jer Scottsoon Network Wave Breaker. <laughs> Yo, get out of my emails! What the fuck? Yeah, right. 
<laughs> it was an NDA. Come on. Yo, that's actually like <laughs> such a good like April Fool's joke. Watch uh, out, April first. I'm, I'm writing it down. I'm writing it down. I'm writing it down. I'm writing that down. I'm taking that. That's now my intellectual property. Thank you. <laughs> I own that. <laughs> it's fucked up. Uh, did anybody get it yet? Uh, uh, there's, there's, a, they're naming all the other bands, but we were talking about that before. Oh wait, there uh, it is. The Punk Rocketeer got it. Punk Rocketeer, the Ultra Ball. Yes. Yes, you got it. No, Nick, but I will say that Pokemon Liberation Front kind of jacked my shit. I've been, <laughs> Pokemon I've been Liberation do- Front. <laughs> yeah, well, there's a there's a band called Pokemon Re- Liberation. I've been doing the Ultra Ball since I was uh, 20 years old, so 15 years technically. Yeah. Yep. yep. Uh, Punk Rocketeer, could you please send me a message on Instagram or something? Uh, I guess I can. I'll figure out. I'll figure out who you are. Uh, I know who Adam is, and I know who Flying Raccoon Suit is. Actually, can you get the Punk Rocketeer? Can you get what size shirt they wear? Because I can send, uh, I'll send them uh, an Ultra Ball shirt too. Punk Rocketeer, what size shirt are you? If you can guess what size shirt Punk Rocketeer is in the chat, you get a (laughs) (laughs) 7-inch. Oh, You get a test press of the Jer Scottsun Network Wave Breaker. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, Elliot finally didn't win something. Sorry, <laughs> Elliot. <laughs> Elliot's streak has been broken. This is now an anti Elliot stream. Jared Spitzer says L. Let's see. I don't know. Wait, what we is, don't know what the answer. I thought, I thought I thought Jared was saying L like took an L like took an L. Took an L. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought too. That's what I was saying. Elliot Springfield got it. XL. So Elliot did win something. Oh, Go okay, Elliot! Okay. Hell yeah! Elliot gets a. <laughs> Elliot gets a. Okay, I got this all written down. All right, tight. Well, <laughs> well, that was a lot of fun. Hell yeah! Next time we'll do a call in. Um, I don't know. Is there anything else y'all want to say about the record? I mean, like, can I tell my Shania Twain or not Shania? Oh, my Carol Crow story, real yeah, fucking sh- quick. Shania Payne. So, Shania Payne. My Shania. No. So my Cheryl Crow story. Um, so at my work, they play. Um, this is. I feel like ill times because now we just had all this fun giving away shit um okay so at my work <laughs> they, they um they'll play uh what's that song i want to soak up the sun yeah they edit that song at my work because the first line is my friend the communist yeah they take that first half of the verse out and what? then <laughs> i'm not even fucking kidding you they just chop it out it's completely gone and then the second verse starts with I've got a crummy job. It don't pay near enough. They cut that shit too. It's, it's Why like, do they play the song? Right? It's like, oh, cause there's like, oh, it's a fun song about being at the beach and having fun. <laughs> it's like, literally it's really a credit to talking. Cheryl Crow though. It's a credit to how positive that song is. Despite, uh, that's so funny. It's It's just just some, like, boring dystopian shit that, like, we live in this bizarre capitalist hellhole that they're just like, (laughs) we're going to sing just the parts about having fun in the sun and not the parts about communism or about not making enough money and the failings of capitalism. Like, it's real bizarre. That's really funny. I guess that's why you wanted to talk about it specifically after Labor Day. Yes, because it (laughs) happens at my work, which is where, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Wow. I mean, we live in a veritable uh, capitalist hellscape. So yeah. sorry, everybody. We lose. <laughs> well, sorry, everyone. So everyone is, gets a seven inch. It's <laughs> a good time to mention. Uh, if you haven't, inch. if you haven't pre-ordered the record yet, please go do so. Uh, yeah. That would be sick if you did. Um, yeah. Speaking of scapitalism. <laughs> scapitalism. Uh, <laughs> Uh, there's a shirt too. There's a shirt. I'm gonna print shirts. They're gonna be sick. I'm gonna DIY the fuck out of those shirts. And uh, tomorrow's the last day you can buy them. So I'll leave them up tomorrow. But then they're gone. So get the shirt. Get the vinyl. Thanks to everybody who did. I don't know. Any other final thoughts from anybody? Or 
go stream the record at midnight. You got an hour and a half. <laughs> and listen, yeah, you, if, can hear, you can hear the last track there too. So it'll be, and just really bum yourself out with that one. If everybody in watching right now at midnight puts it on, puts the record on repeat and you just let it go all night, then we could go to the rock room and buy three pierogies. So, <laughs> So, so that's please, true. but it's Thank also not Spotify. a bad idea. If you want, if you want to go do that, that's not a bad idea. Pick, yeah. <laughs> just go leave it on. All right. Sick. Uh, Thank you guys right. so much. This has been a lot of fun. Yeah. 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 Thank really you, Jeremy. It. Yeah. Thank you so much for hosting this shit. This is awesome. Yeah, of course. Thank y'all for making a badass record. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks DC for hosting the. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah, appreciate that, man. Thanks, DC producer extraordinaire, for holding it down in the in the in the in the dark in the back. Uh, yeah, and yeah. If any of my managers are watching this, I'm not coming in tomorrow. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> you, can, you can get fucked. My bad. <laughs> I, you know, I'd like to think that they are watching, but something tells me. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> <laughs> They're asleep. Uh, well, this is fun as hell, and yeah, thanks for making a fucking badass amazing record please go listen to it at midnight <clears throat> yeah uh, and thanks for thanks for thanks for being here and uh i don't know i think we'll i think we'll do another i think we'll do another stream another stream right jeremy yeah maybe yeah maybe we'll see we'll see <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what happens we'll see if anything we'll, anything see. Happens. we'll see what happens all right well good night